Psalms chapter 87 On the holy mount stands the city he founded The Lord loves the gates of Zion more than all the dwelling places of Jacob Glorious things of you are spoken O city of God Among those who know me I mention Rahab and Babylon Behold Philistia and Tyre with Cush This one was born there they say and of Zion it is it shall be said this one and that one were born in her for the most high himself will establish her the lord records as he registers the peoples this one was born there singers and dancers alike say all my springs are in you psalms chapter 88 O Lord God of my salvation I cry out day and night before you let my prayer come before you incline my incline your ear to my cry for my soul is full of troubles and my life draws near to Sheol I am counted among those who go down the pit I am a man who has no strength like one who set loose among the dead like the slain that lie in the grave like those whom you remember no more for they are cut off from your hand you have put me in the depths of the pit in the regions dark and deep your wrath lies heavy upon me and you overwhelm me with your waves you have caused my companions to shun me you have made a horror You have made me a horror to them I am shunned in so that I cannot escape my eye grows dim through sorrow every day I call upon you O Lord I spread out my hands to you do you work wonders for the dead do the departed rise up to praise praise you is your steadfast love declared in the grave or your faithfulness in abaddon are your wonders known in the darkness or your righteousness in the land of forgetfulness but i o lord cry to you in the morning my prayer comes before you o lord why do you cast me and my soul away why do you hide your face from me afflicted and close to death from my youth up i suffer your terrors i am helpless your wrath has swept over me your dreadful assaults destroy me they surround me like a flood all day long they close in on me together you have caused my beloved and my friend to shun me my companions have become darkness psalms chapter 89 i'll sing of the steadfast love of the lord forever with my mouth i will make known your faithfulness to all generations for i said steadfast love will be built up forever in the heavens you will establish your faithfulness you have said I have made a covenant with my chosen one I have sworn to David my servant I'll establish your offspring forever and build your throne for all generations Let the heavens praise your wonders O Lord your faithfulness in the assembly of the holy ones for who in the skies can be compared to the Lord who among the whole heavenly beings is like the Lord a god greatly to be feared in the council of the holy ones and awesome above all who are around them and awesome all above all who are around him o lord god of hosts who is mighty as you are o lord with your faithfulness all around you you rule the raging of the sea when its waves rise you still them You crushed Rahab like a carcass. You scattered your enemies with your mighty arm. The heavens are yours, the earth also is yours. 
the world and all that is in it you have founded them the north and the south you have created them tabor and harman joyously praise your name you have a mighty arm strong in your hand high your right hand righteousness and justice are the foundation of your throne steadfast love and faithfulness go before you blessed are the people who know the feastal shout who walk o lord in the light of your face who exult in your name all the day and in your righteousness are exalted for you are the glory of their strength by your favor our horn is exalted for our shield belong belongs to the lord our king to the holy one of israel of old you spoke in a vision to your godly one and said i have granted help to one who is mighty i have exalted one chosen from the people i have found a david my servant with my holy oil i have anointed him so that my hand shall be established with him my arm also shall strengthen him the enemy shall not outwit him the wicked shall not humble him i will crush his foes before him and strike down those who hate him my faithfulness and my steadfast love shall be with him and in my name sh- shall his horn be exalted i will set his hand on the sea and his right hand on the rivers he shall cry to me you are my father my god and the rock of my salvation and i will make him the first born the highest of the kings of the earth my steadfast love i will keep for him forever and my covenant will stand firm for him i will establish his offspring forever and his throne as the days of the heavens if his children forsake my law and do not walk according to my rules if they violate my statutes and do not keep my commandments then i will punish their transgression with the rod and their iniquity with stripes but i will not remove from him my steadfast love or be false to my faithfulness i will not violate my covenant or alter the word that went forth from my lips once for all i have sworn by my holiness i will not lie to david his offspring shall endure forever his throne as long as the sun before me like the moon it shall be established forever a faithful witness in the skies but now you have cast off and rejected you are full of wrath against your anointed you have renounced the covenant with your servant you have defiled his crown in the dust you have breached all his walls you have laid his strongholds in ruin all who pass by plunder him he has become the scorn of his neighbors you have exalted the right hand of his foes you have made all his enemies rejoice you have also turned back the edge of his sword and you have not made him stand in the battle you have made his splendor to cease and cast his throne to the ground you have cut short the days of his youth you have covered him with shame how long o oh lord will you hide yourself forever how long will you will your wrath burn like fire remember how short my time is for what vanity you have created all the children of man what man can live and never see death who can deliver his soul from the power of sheol lord 
where is your steadfast love of old which by your faithfulness you sowed to david remember all oh lord how your servants are mocked and how i bear in my heart the insults of all the many nations with which your enemies mock o oh lord with which they mock the footstep of your anointed blessed be the lord forever amen and amen psalms chapter 90 Lord you have been our dwelling place in all generations before the mountains were brought forth or ever you had formed the earth and the world from everlasting to everlasting you are God you return man to dust and say return o children of man for a thousand years in your sight are but as yesterday when it is past or as a watch in the night you sweep them away as with a flood they are like a dream like grass that is renewed in the morning in the morning it flourishes and is renewed in the evening it fades and withers for we are brought to an end by your anger by your wrath we are dismayed You have set our iniquities before you, our secret sins in the light of your presence. For all our days pass away under your wrath. We bring our years to an end like a sigh. The years of our life are seventy, or even by reason of strength, eighty. Yet their span is but toil and trouble. they are soon gone and we fly away who considers the power of your anger and your wrath according to the fear of you so teach us to number our days that we may get a heart of wisdom return o lord how long have pity on your servants satisfy us in the morning with your steadfast love that we may rejoice and be glad all our days make us glad for as many days as you have afflicted us and for as many years as we have seen evil let your work be shown to your servants and your glorious power to their children let the favor of the lord our god be upon us and establish the work of our hands upon us yes establish the work of our hands